Hey guys, welcome to Healthy with Tammy. I'm back just for a quick, uh, maybe eight, 10 minute workout. It's gonna be a booty and core um, style workout. So there's going to be three moves, only two blocks today, all right? We're gonna repeat those three moves twice. We're gonna work that booty and that core, all right? So let's just stretch it out a little bit. Bring that arm over. You always want to stretch before and after a workout, okay? Prevents injuries. Bring those arms out to the front. Good, now bring those arms back up. Cross that leg over and dive down for those toes. Feel the stretch in those hammies, right up to that booty that we're gonna be working. Come on, let's go the other way. Arms up and switch to the other side. Bring it down and hold. Good, come back up. Drop that head to the side, one hand behind. And let's switch it to the other side. All right, so a little bit stretched out. All right, so the first move we're gonna do, you're just gonna need yourself one dumbbell, I think, for both um, blocks. Yes, one dumbbell. Doesn't have to be heavy because we're concentrating on the booty and the core. All right, so the first one we're gonna do, we are going to do a side lunge to a stack to a front lunge overhead press. So it looks like this. You're gonna hold that, you're gonna hold this weight in your opposite hand, feet together. You're gonna side lunge, tap that weight if you can, come up and stack it, and then same leg lunges forward, press it over the head. So it's side lunge, stack, front lunge, overhead press, all right? Then we're gonna do a, come down on our back, we're gonna do four back strokes and um, two starfish. I'll show you what it looks like when we get there. All right, so I'm gonna start that timer. Grab your dumbbell, let's get this done. Very quick and effective workout for you. Coming from Healthy with Tammy, remember my, my motto is CP, consistency and patience. That's how you're gonna live a healthy lifestyle. Come on, side lunge tap, then press it over the head, front lunge. Make sure that knee is over that ankle. When you do that front lunge, push off that heel to come out of it. Side lunge tap, front lunge press. Yes. Push that booty back. Up. You got it. And press. There it is. We gotta do the same thing to the other side. So make sure your toes and knees stay forward the entire time. Ready, here we go. Side lunge. Stack that weight. Press it up over the head. Remember the same leg that's lunging to the side lunges to the front. Down. Together. Press. Always oh, squeezing that booty at the top. Come on, squeeze right here. Don't rush it. Get that back lunge as low as you can. When that bell rings, we're going down to the floor. Four back strokes. Two starfish. There it is. So you're here. Feet are two inches from the ground. Shoulders are up. One, two, three, four. Lift. And lift, let's go. Tap, two, three, four. Oop, oop, do it again. One, come on, shoulders up. If your back is arching, then keep your feet down. Right here, feet down, shoulders up. Two, three, four, reach for the opposite toe. Come on, burn out that core. Yes, it's on fire. Oop. Good, let's do it again. Round two, now you know it, let's perfect it. Feet together, side lunge, stack, front lunge, overhead press. Here we go. Side lunge, stack it, and press. Come on, push it back. Oh yeah, look, your toes and knees stay forward the entire time. Don't turn that toe out to the corner of the room on that side lunge. You got it. Woo! Push it back. Squeeze it. Rest. Let's do it one more time. Other side. Feet together. Going the other way. Opposite hand, opposite foot. Go. Side lunge. Stack. Press. Come on, you get that back knee low? Of course you are. Come on, front knee is over that ankle. Side lunge. Stack. Press. Come on, almost. Down. Whoop. You're so close. Come back down on the floor. 
four for those back strokes. Four back strokes, two starfish. Come on, get those feet two inches from the ground. Shoulders up, tap those thumbs. Reach, up. One, two, three, four, up. Come on, yes you can. You are stronger than you think. Your body can handle it. Now just convince your mind. Come on, 10 seconds. Two, three. Say, I can, I can, I can. And you will. One, two, three. Riz. All right, guys, that block's done. Let me explain the next one. So we're going to do an oblique pull down. Again, one light weight or no weight. You can do it without a weight, all right? One toe is out to the side. The arm is up. You're pulling it and reaching. So you're reaching and pulling. Elbow to that hip, all right? So it's not a knee lift. You're pulling it out to the side. It's like an oblique crunch standing up. You know those love handles? We'll do right and left. Then we're gonna come down on the ground on our backs, two side to side heel taps, and then two glute squeezes. I'll show you, here we go. Pull it up, pull, resist, pull. Now resist as you bring that leg down. Don't just drop that leg. You want to control it all the way through. Come on, pull and press. Make sure you're reaching. You're getting that full stretch and that oblique. Up. Come on, yes you can. As soon as that toe taps, it comes right back up. You can put that hand here if you need it for balance here. Yes, you're also working on your balance. The stronger your core is, the better your balance is going to be. The stronger your core is, the better everything's gonna be. All right, back, balance, come on. Arm up, we're going the other way, same thing. Come on, pull, and resist. Whoop. Yes, you can. Woo! Pull, resist. Come on, you got it. Whoop, finish it. Inhale, exhale, don't hold your breath. You're there, two, one, and rest, good. Come on down on your back, you don't need any weights. Feet are close to that butt, shoulders up. Four side taps, reaching for the side of that shoe. Two butt lifts, here we go. One, two, three, shoulders up for those side taps. Squeeze, come on, on those heels, all the way through the heels, come on. Lift those toes, three, four. Oop. One more. Come on, guys. We're almost to the end. It's only two small blocks today. Two, three, four. Lift it up. Right to the end. You are not done until that bell rings. We got to do it one more time, guys. You got less than two minutes to work. Yes, you can. Get that arm up. Toe out. Pull it. Come on, crunch it. Work those love handles. Come on, you got it. Inhale, exhale. Remember, you're not pulling the knee towards the chest. You're pulling the outer thigh towards that elbow. Come on, you got it. Remember, you want to reach. Full range of motion here. Let's go. Pull. Come on, you got it. That side's done. We gotta finish off the other side. We gotta be even. Come on, inhale and exhale. Catch your breath. Get that arm up. Toe out to the side. Come on, pull. Resist. Pull. Whoop. You got it. You got it. Come on, guys. You got less than one minute of work to go. Woo! And if you want, you can replay it and do it again. Oh yeah. Come on guys, set goals. You gotta set yourself some goals, crush those goals, and then set yourself some new goals. Always should be a challenge, all right? Always should be a struggle. Come on. I don't care how experienced you are. You gotta push harder every day. Here we go, two, four side reaches. One, two, three, four. Two hip ups. Come on, squeeze that butt. Let me see those dimples. One, two, three. Four. Whoop. Squeeze. One, 
two, three, four. Come on, single digits, so close to the end. loud when my timer goes off. Let's just stretch it out real quick. I want you to bring that, remember I said stretch before and after. One foot over the other. If you have to hold on to something, your dog, your couch, your uh, wall, whatever it is, push against that inner thigh so you feel a nice stretch in that glute bead, that whole area that we just worked very hard. Good. And switch to the other side. Come on. One foot over. Yes, you need core strength so that you can balance yourself. Good. Remember, guys, what I said. CP, consistency and patience. That's what's going to get you there. All right? If you have a bad day, you don't say, oh, well, I give up. No, it's not how it works. That's not a healthy lifestyle. You know what? You go on a quick diet, you fail, you give up, you gain the weight back and even more weight back. So, um, if you guys, I am a nutrition coach. Any, if you want to reach out to me, I can help you. But you have to make it a lifestyle. It's not a quick fix. So that's where it's consistency and patience. Bring those hands to the floor, roll it up nice and slow, big inhale at the top, and exhale. Thanks for joining me, Healthy with Tammy. Bye now.